What's up guys, Hot Noob here. Um, it's July 19th, and in this video I'm going to be uh, letting the chickens out of the run for an hour or so. It's um, it's 7.30pm uh, p.m. or so, and then they usually go into the coop by 9.30 to 10, around that. So that'll give them about um, two and a half hours or so. Um, I guess normally you'd start off by letting them out for an hour, but um, I noticed the first time they went quite a bit later with uh, an hour. So I think that's because, you know, they want to get their fill of crickets or grasshoppers in this case. So, um, yeah, I want to give them some extra time for their first time or whatever so they can get their fill of uh, grasshoppers. I do have a hazard that I'm a little bit worried about, but um, after seeing a rabbit run by, or whatever, like a baby rabbit run by across while I was digging a couple days ago, um, I think it should be okay for me to let them out while there's a six foot deep trench, about a hundred feet. Um, hopefully they won't drip off, and I've seen them fly about, uh, jump off from like four feet or so already, so three and a half feet so I think should be able to handle six feet based on um, how far I've seen them fly without really hurting themselves if they accidentally run off anyways so um, yeah um, and track is kind of out of order right now too so um, I don't know when it'll be uh, replaced I've got a warranty claim started or whatever so they're apparently going to be bringing me another tractor or something. Or I'm just going to pick this up. I haven't gotten the finer details. But anyways. Um, the other condition that I wanted uh, before lighting the moat was to have the electrical uh, fencing going on. So that way they don't get um, too comfortable with the yellow wire. Um, I've got it hooked up now. Gives you a little bit of a zap or whatever. I shocked myself like three times already. But it's not that bad. It's like a... It doesn't hurt. It's just like a... You know, jolt. Kind of WTF. Alright. So I'm just going to unhook this. i got to grab the bear banger first. Oh, I'm going to shock myself. It's right next there. Okay. Shorting on the grass. So, yeah. Um, I don't know. It was like a week ago. What was the bird of prey? Or maybe half a week. Gotta get in here. Come on. So just in, in case some um, coyotes or a bear or a bird comes by, um, probably going to be this entire year that every time I let them out, I'm going to have to supervise. So um, until I get, uh, get a dog and everything. Um, and then next year, I also want to get a guinea fowl. So combined with a dog should be some defense. Um... Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully no one gets killed. Okay, and I didn't shock myself. All right. That's it. Let's see if they come out.
Everybody went out there. They're catching them a little bit easier than I thought I would. They seem to run around quite a bit more in the run, but I guess right now the grasshoppers are kind of slow because it's near the end of the day, so easier to catch. All right, I'm gonna have to end this video because the mosquitoes are killing me. Um, this hot new pier, please subscribe.